All right, homies, pretty uh, intense day of sitting down, busting out some awesome marketing stuff for some of my marketing clients. Absolutely love them. To all of you out there that are part of Andrew.Social, thank you, you rock, and I love working on marketing with all of you. Now, today's a fun day. I got a couple different things going on. The first is a meeting with Marion Maid. It's kind of like an organization slash marketing campaign for the city of Marion, talking about all the cool stuff happening in Marion and focusing on small businesses. I'm gonna meet with them right now. After that, I'm gonna show you something that happened yesterday. One of the most random things in my entire life, but it was really cool and I was able to connect with someone doing something absolutely awesome. I'll tell you and show you about that. And then finally, I need to draw up some plans for the inside of that building that we saw last video. Yeah, like I said, pretty packed day. So uh, let's start that journey right now. Off to a meeting with Marion Maid. Oh yeah, uh, you're coming with me. Awesome meeting with the uh, Marion Maid crew. We're gonna be working on a couple projects together, talking about how awesome Marion is and the great things that are happening in our community. Cannot wait for that. So uh, stay tuned. Like I said, some really sweet projects that we get to work on together. Looking forward to it. Now uh, off to another meeting. I have so many freaking meetings. It's just a weird time, but it's good. We got a call with one of our lovely potential marketing clients that I'm very excited to work with. Hopefully we can get some details knocked out. Can you even see in here? Yeah, check this out. What do you want this space to be? Give me something crazy, something cool. Give me ideas. Well, another fantastic meeting. Now, I want to share with you something I talked about at the beginning of this video. There's this guy that stopped me when I was riding my bike yesterday. And he was like, dude, I have this crazy question for you. He's doing this really cool, creative, artistic photography piece and project about the elements that went into creating the Panama Canal. So he's not necessarily focusing on the history of the Panama Canal, but kind of how the elements and the people and the places that influenced the creation of the Panama Canal, how all of those things are doing present day and how those communities are developing. So for example, he was in Marion kind of focusing on that project. And uh, I recorded a little clip with him yesterday, so uh, check it out. All right, so you know I'm just hanging out in Marion, riding my bike around because that's what I do. Uh, chilling right there, my dude. And rolling along, some guy in a car stops and says, hey dude, I got a weird question to ask you. For he like asked me about my history of Marion and all that kind of stuff, and then says, dude, can I take your picture? You don't normally get that. I mean, I'm a good looking dude, sure, like whatever. <laughs> I dig that, but it's just not a normal question to ask. So we had a little bit of a conversation and this guy right here is doing something amazing and I'm gonna have him tell you about it right now. It turns out Marion's a, a big deal uh, for the construction of the Panama, Panama Canal. Uh, steam shovel was made here and stuff. So, so I came to town and I'm trying to photograph, you know, the place as it is now. Um, not concentrating so much on the history stuff, but kind of, uh, you know, trying to see how you know, this place moving forward, uh, how industry is different now, uh, you know, what people, what people are doing now to, to keep this place rolling. More importantly, like, uh, have a way of communicating to an audience, uh, particularly in my country, um, that it is, you know, these people in this town who today are working to do exciting, innovate, innovative things. Um, the people who are, you know, basically the, the, the fiber of our own history in Panama. Andre's super cool dude. I'm excited to see the fruition of this project, but now we have one last thing to do. I need to go draw something. We're still doing the floor. That's Cody. It's so freaking tedious to do it that way. And so just, now I'm just thinking about just trying to pour that stuff on it. Squeeze! Skirt! Yeah, the floor still sucks, but those guys don't. So that's cool. 
So, uh, you know, I was actually... <laughs> I was gonna... I was gonna come down here and, like, try to sketch this place out. Really? Yeah. Uh, shout out to Lauren Cameron. What's yeah. up? Dude, Lauren's sweet. Let's go. You say your what? As you all know, I'm trying to do something with this building that is in downtown Marion. And first things first, let's recognize the beauty of this natural stone wall. I love it. I love it. Now, the next step in this process, after we still continue to get this cleaned out, that's the longest part of this whole process. Second part is designing the interior. And like I said, I'm gonna be drawing. I'm gonna try to draw the interior. This could be a struggle, but uh, let's go for it. All right, what looks better, my drawing or this pile of floor gunk? Drawing, pile of floor gunk. Yeah, that's what I thought. While I may not be the best architectural drawler in the world, we are planning something sweet for this space, and I am hype to share it all with you very soon. And that time is coming soon, and uh, extremely soon, because uh, we're getting stuff done, and we have a very... Very quick timeline. I'm excited for it, and you all should be too. I love Marion, guys. This is so exciting.